Hello guys, uh, Lewis here. Welcome back to another video. This is just going to be a super quick video on the release of the FIFA editor tool for FIFA 21. Yes, we can mod FIFA 21. Um, a new software has been released. Uh, I did not develop it. However, I have organized and funded the project and it allows modders and anyone to mod FIFA 20 and also comes with a mod manager, same as Frosty, that can import and launch mods. For about the Realism mod, this means the Realism mod is coming very soon. Uh, there'll be a few updates about that in the next few days. Anyways, uh, I'm just going to quickly go through what, what it can do and how you can download it. So uh, what it can do, it has very similar function to Frosty, uh, similar look about it with a few added features. Still doesn't support everything. The current release doesn't support EBX editing, so hotspots or mesh exporting or importing. But by the time you're watching it, it well could support those things. Um, so yeah, just check what version it is. Check the change logs, check the Twitter, everything like that. Um, and join the Discord to to ask or ask in the comments. So uh, to download it, just go to fifaeditortool.com. Uh, should bring you to this website. Uh, I would recommend you don't uh, you uh, you disable your ad blocker because uh, ads are how uh, the the tool uh, raises its money to keep being developed. It's a large portion of that. So uh, if you want, you know, the tool is 100% free. So if you want to help it keep that way then I would recommend you turn off your ad blocker. So you can see some images here. These might be different. You can see the Discord here. I'd recommend just click connect. You'll join totally free. You can get live help, progress updates, stuff like that. And then down here, you can see a few more things. We'll get into this later. But if you want to download it, just click the purple download button. Um, and once you get to download, there'll be two things. So you'll see uh, the version. Currently, it's V1.0.1. Um, and I'll make videos when new version released here. But uh, when you're watching this, could this could well be a version of the future. So you'll notice the editor, mod manager, and then the change log. So you can read through the change log if you want to see what the latest changes are. You can see past versions if we click on this. Um, we can see the 1.0, we can download that um, and all that. Um, but the editor is, uh, is the tool that can be used to create mods with the ability to import and export textures, legacy files, and rest slash chunk files with many more features like a super advanced search bar and uh, all that kind of stuff. So yeah, if you're a modder or you want to create mods, use that. Then the mod manager you can use to import and apply mods made from others or yourself uh, made by the editor and has the power to play with multiple mods at the same time. So if you don't want to be bothered with making them, you just want to open open a tool, import some mods, launch the game, the mod manager is for you. So we can just click on either um, and it'll bring us to the respective mega file. Um, so uh, just download it, it's free. Um, uh, just, you know, 60 megabytes around each. Um, if you want a, a great file uh, hosting platform for your business or for your personal stuff, I would recommend Mega. Um, been using it a lot these days. It's it's super impressive. So you can just go, so you can just go here, create account or uh, products stuff like that. But yeah, then just click download, give it a second to download, um, and then I'll come back to you when the RARs have downloaded. In the meantime, they'll quickly tell you about the Patreon. If you want to support development in a in a in a way much better than just you know uh, going on the website and having ads, then this is the way to do it. Even just one dollar makes a huge difference. Um, uh, and there's very various rewards you get. For instance, uh, the supporter role you get uh, to vote on features, Discord server access to some special uh, channels and whatnot. For uh, $3, you get daily progress updates. For $5, you get beta testing, so you can test lots of beta builds with new uh, advanced features. Uh, there may be more uh, ones added in the future. And then for alpha testers, you can get uh, alpha testing privileges. And right now, there's an alpha with EBX editing and, and some other cool stuff. Um, so yeah, that's, uh, that's all about uh, the Patreon. There's also a Twitter. Um, which is great, I would recommend you follow it uh, at FIFA Editor Tool, link in the description for everything here, of course. You get progress updates, downloads, stuff like that. Uh, and you can also get some help there too. And then obviously the Discord, recommend you join that too. But let's just wait until both of these download. So then when they have downloaded, you can just click on the RAR, um, obviously install WinRAR, and then basically just extract this onto your PC. This is not going to be a tutorial, it's just more of an announcement. Uh, there will be tutorials coming up very soon when they are, I'll link them in the description. This is just a tiny basic installation tutorial. You open these up, you can see the contents, just extract the folder, then run the exe, it'll ask you for an encryption key, you can find that on Google. But more about that coming very, very soon in my next few videos. This is just a quick announcement to tell you that we can now mod FIFA 21. And yeah, that's about it. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys in the next one. Goodbye. I've been running out of time. Think I need to rewind. Feeling out of life. I put in.
Put everything aside, hoping that I make it right All the things I do for you 